Why is it that when I try to get this transform graph, it is taking the original graph and translating it by two units to the right instead of to the left? This can be very easily explained if you were to look at the similarity between these two graphs. And the similarity is the function f. So if I were to work on the function f and imagining it as if when I put in a 3, I'm going to get back a 7. So on this particular graph, if I were to get back a 7, what I need to do is to let x be equal to 3, which means that on this graph, I will have a point 3, 7. But on this particular graph, in order for me to get a 7, what I need to do is to let x be equal to 5, because 5 minus 2 is 3, and then f3 will lead me to a 7, which means that on this graph, I will have a point 5, 7 instead. So from 3 becomes 5. It is a translation of 2 units to the right. We can make use of the same explanation for the graph of y is equal to f2x. So is this an expansion or is this a compression? Let's find out. If I were to expect this graph to produce for me a 7, what I need to do is to let x be equal to 3 over 2. So using the same idea, on this particular graph, we will be expecting a point 3 over 2, 7 instead of a point 3, 7. So from 3 goes to 3 over 2, it is a compression of 2 times parallel to the x-axis.